Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Pinky. I'm an advanced clinical pharmacist practitioner. Today I'm going to show you how you can like identify if you have got low blood pressure, heart failure or low blood volume. It's a simple test to measure for the color to return to normal after pressure is applied typically at the end of the finger with the help of the thumb and forefinger less than two seconds is normal i'm going to show you how to carry out the test okay it's a very simple test and you have to remember that less than two seconds for the color to return to normal after pressing with the thumb and forefinger is normal so let's see how the test is done okay now i'm going to show you how to carry out this simple test in two seconds okay so make sure you are not wearing a wristwatch no nail color okay you use your forefinger and your thumb and press tightly on your nail bed and release it and now when you're going to release it you need to count from one to two seconds and if the normal color is back, then your blood flow is normal, okay? So it did came back to normal. I'm gonna try and do it in another finger. One, two, yes. The normal color is back. That means my blood flow is normal okay this is a very important test so the medical term for this test is capillary refill test now capillary refill test is widely used for patients who are like acutely unwell or in an emergency situation they're widely used this test can be affected by many reasons so, say for example if somebody is elderly um, lighting the pressure applied and if somebody is like very cold or if there is any kind of you know um, disease of the uh, vascular system in the body some some medical conditions does affect the timing of the capillary refill test now it's very very important this is not a full assessment capillary refill test is not the full assessment it's part of the assessment you have to understand that it's very important um, capillary refill test is a big part um, of the circulation assessment now there are other things that needs to be considered as well such as the pulse rate pulse volume blood pressure urine output temperature now it's also important to um, look at the patient look at their skin color and uh, the temperature of the skin as i have mentioned it's very important and another thing is what is the level of consciousness of the patient okay i'm, I'm going to make a video on how to take the pulse rate and hopefully everybody's gonna watch it now all i want is everybody to try and uh, give yourself two seconds press your finger bed nail and see what's happening so capillary refill test um, if the time is more than two seconds okay for the color to become to normal then it's also important tool capillary filter test is also an important tool to identify if you're dehydrated or not so the signs of dehydration can be like um, feeling thirsty dark yellow orange smelling pee feeling very dizzy lightheaded then feeling very tired lethargy dry lips eyes mouth being very little uh, usually like less than four times a day and so that's all about capillary refill test i hope this video is very helpful for you do like share and subscribe my channel and follow me on facebook page thank you and my facebook page is clinical pharmacist practitioner pinky